hope you are resting peacefully. Okay, on my way. You know, for a decrepit metal cave, it's pretty cozy in here, too. Plenty of dark, moody corners. <laughs> Another fortunate swing of the hammer for old Gildan? Aloy! My flame haired Nora, my damn fixer, my second set of hands! Who would have thought we'd meet again in such familiar circumstances? Ha! Ah, certainly not me. <laughs> what are you doing here? Well, now, it all started when I heard the echoes of a most peculiar voice beckoning me into this beguiling place. But I resisted. I knew this was a special delve, one I had to share, so I went and fetched my friend Olvar, who was more than willing. And where is he? Alas, we got separated when we sailed into a howling tempest on the way back here. Blew me right overboard. I floundered about in the waves, certain I'd become snap maw bait. But nope. The sea spat old Gildan right out onto the shore. Olvar undoubtedly thought I was a goner and pressed on, as any true delver would. I followed in his footsteps as far as I could, until I came across a door that wouldn't budge. Naturally. I searched for another means of entry. That's when I uncovered an ancient lever, tantalizing in its door-opening potential. So you pulled the lever. I pulled the lever, which may have, upon reflection, sealed this door shut behind me. And thus do we find ourselves once again at a fortuitous meeting. Tell me about this Olvar guy. Our bond was forged on the road to these uncharted shores. Night after night, I relayed my previous ventures to my traveling companions. Olvar took it all in with a fascinated silence. So when we got here, we agreed to share our fortunes. The look on his face when I told him about this place. Nothing quite like the joy of a new delve shared with good company. After I fell off our boat, I searched all over for him. I was starting to think him lost when I found his camp up top. He'll be as happy as a sun-kissed Karja to find out I'm not dead. I'm sure he will. Okay, so let me get this straight. You think Olvar somehow managed to get deeper in the ruin? Courtesy of a handy-dandy shaft. Or, well... Not so handy dandy now that some rubble's blocked the way. Right, so if we're gonna find him, we need to find a way past that door you mentioned. We? Yes, Gildan, I will help you find Olvar. Make sure you don't get yourself trapped again. <laughs> Marvelous! Just like old times. You with your surprising and perplexing ways. Me with my nose for danger and excitement. The door lies just ahead. After you. Welcome to my humble, temporary abode. Nice place. Indeed! Would have loved to share this discovery with Olvar. Regrettably, I tumbled into the sea as the ruin entered our sights. Could imagine my joy discovering my lanterns in this tunnel. Presuming me dead, Olvar put them to good use. So resourceful. And here I present our hinged hindrance, the finale of our grand tour. What? 
Yep, definitely blocked. Not my first impassable obstacle. You've returned! Shall we get back to it? We'll need a passcode to get through. Passcode? <laughs> of course! What, uh, is that? A set of numbers. Let's look around. If I were a passcode, where would I hide? Maybe we can find it somewhere. We could try retracing our steps. An ingenious idea! Well, there's a passcode left behind by one of the old ones. He was alone here. He broadcast the recording, hoping others would join him. Did anyone come? Not sure. Shall we try that uh, passcode out? I'm just itching for you to meet Olvar. Stone, malodorous mildew, a Delver's dream. Looks like someone tried to blast into that room across the way. Olvar's never been stingy on the blast paste. Control panels fried. The old ones must have loved spending time underground to build these. Yep! This pile of rubble is definitely an Ovar special. Well, the path's blocked now. We'll have to find another way up. How do you suppose they went about creating these tunnels? By hand? Can I, uh, get Blast some help? Paste? Anything you need! All right, let's push. Ah, the joys of locomotion! Did you hear that? Yep, let's keep our guard up. Tell you, the number of domes where a crate saved my hide. Or nearly crushed it. Hmm. Do 
Door needs a code and key module. Hang tight down there. I'll look around. No worthwhile delve is free of its devilish challenges. Maybe my focus can help me find a way past this cart. Maybe there's a way with less falling. Check this vent, see what I find. Best of luck! Personally, I've always been more proficient at losing things than finding them. You name it, I misplaced it. Hammers, sharks, rats, rooms. I even lost my precious looking glass falling into the sea. I see you haven't lost your knack for hazardous traversal! Oh! oh! You're fine! Of course. World friends left us another code. A true gentleman. I'll bet plenty of people answered his call. It doesn't look like it. I'm here.
Sunshine. Valuable stuff. Moves the elevator. Hey, Gildan! Hop in! Noise again. It sounds like it's closer. Could use that card on the upper floor to climb higher. Need to find a way on top of it first. Only we had the good fortune to stumble upon another metal crate. Or we could bring the one we've got upstairs.
elevator could help me get the crate upstairs.